All right, students, today is experimentation day. I want you to remember back to last week when we watched that clip of Jurassic Park that didn't have any music on it. I know we've had a few technical difficulties, so if you haven't been able to see that clip, here it is now. This species of veriformin has been extinct since the Cretaceous period. I mean, this thing is a lot of this thing. What? This week, starting actually on Thursday, so the later part of this week, we will begin making our own tracks to that Jurassic Park clip. We'll be getting very creative with it and having some teachers decide which ones they think are the best. Then as a class, we will vote for our favorite ones from first grade, second grade, third grade, fourth grade, fifth grade, depending on what grade you're in. But first, we have to figure out the tools that we can use for this part of our music class. So for those of you at home, today is a day for both brainstorming and for experimenting. First, I want you to brainstorm what items in your house you can use for creating music. You can think of lots of different things, like this, or like this, or like this even. You could use anything, but even if you think you really don't have anything at your house that you can use, you can always use your voice or you could clap. After you brainstorm what items you can use, then I want you to experiment for me on Flipgrid. Take a Flipgrid video of yourself playing one of your instruments or several of your instruments and send it as a reply to the last video that I made. If you take your video or your phone like this and you hold it up to the screen, it'll open up a little thing that says open Flipgrid that's a little link for you to use. Then you can press join with Google and you might have to put your username and your password for school into the program so that you can get started. Your Flipgrid videos should look something like this. I can't wait to see how creative you guys all can be, and I'll talk to you again soon. Send me an email if you have any questions. My email address is on PowerSchool on the music page. I'll see your faces very soon.